All right, Ronnie, so check this out. Good playing today, by the way. Thank you. So right to left putt here on the right. So you're, so you're basically saying that... Um, you're, you're out to in on your left to righters. Watch uh -huh. this. Out to in. Mm -hmm. You pulled that one. Where'd that go? Okay. Misread it too. Probably underread it a hair. This one went in. Started a little right. Not bad. That's a good putt. But anyway, look at the backswing over here on this guy here. It's different. Yeah, it's straight back. It's more straight back. Yeah. This one here, it's kind of awesome. so we know it's outside. So bottom line is, we, we don't want differences from stroke mm -hmm. to stroke. We want to have consistency. Yeah. So I brought you in and said, okay, just make, it's dark, you can't really see, but if you could just pick up the putter, one, two, they're going the same, slightly yeah. in or for you, maybe it feels straight back, but it's just going to go slightly to the inside. And now, all we all we care about is that here's here's from the ball to that red line right here, this little T. That's 12 inches. Then from there, I don't care if this this building was sloped to the right and this putt broke that way. You putt this putter back like that. Mm -hmm. I don't care if the putt the hole was over here. You're gonna put it the same way and then it'll break off. Okay. So how you practice that is with string, with rope, okay. like we have outside. Okay. And I want you to go practice the backswing several times, then hit. Practice the backswing several times, then hit. And you can move the rope for a left to righter and a right to lefter. That way you always feel like you're doing the same thing and all you care about is that the putt starts straight. Yeah, it starts straight. Okay. Every putt is straight for the first X number of inches mm -hmm. depending on how much the slope will carry it. And that's what I want better.